Alrighty folks, it's Neato with AP 2020 Outdoors. This is day two of my Baku Flatlander adventures. I'm here at the Groundhog Field of Dreams. What I'm doing today, I'm going to set some groundhog steaks. They're like, groundhog steaks? What the heck are groundhog steaks? Well, stay tuned. I'll take you along for the ride. Alright folks, here we go. <laughs> I love it, man. So this is going to be the first time I don't know if you see my, I got my backpack on. Got my rifle on the back when I actually go groundhog hunting. So I'm here at the uh, Field of Dreams, and uh, I got some stakes. I've got a hammer, and I got my ring finder. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to set up, gonna set up where I normally hunt at in those far woods, and just range everything back. I'm going to map out the entire field. And then that way I'll have consistent yardage. It's kind of like in golf, you know, where you're doing, uh, you got yardage just to the hole from different spots in the fairway. Anyway, this shit should probably be interesting. I'm going to flip the camera around. about the farthest shot here. Go down. So what I've done, I've staked it into the far woods. It is 605 yards. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Look at the buzzards. They're like, uh, okay, this guy's back. Maybe he'll feed us. <laughs> so this one to the back trees is 531 yards. Okay, here's another active hole, getting closer to my hide, 351 yards, there's the edge of the pine trees. So I'm on the east side of the pine trees now, and so I'm going to range to the same woods. I'm just a little bit to the east of that. There's actually a second hole right in front of me, about 25 yards. So I got 452 and 427.
So these groundhogs are like, man, what's this guy doing putting these orange stakes up? <laughs> so this one is actually 398 yards. There's another one up by that tree. That th one I definitely want to stake. That's where I do a lot of my, I've, I've been doing some videos back on the uh, backfield here. Oh yeah, these are definitely freshly drunk, freshly dug. So if you guys have been watching my 204 Ruger splash videos, you'll recognize this hole. And to that woods, it's 319. Okay, this will be the last one I staked today. And this is the last one I'm going to stake because I ran out of stakes. This should be a chip shot, 247 yards. Whoa. Hi folks. Well, the big takeaway, that coup flatlander, I don't know if the uh, flatlander is the right turn. This thing is handling the hills with no issues, man. I mean, I'm like pretty shocked. You know what I'm loving? Is that I can check out territory that I normally probably wouldn't be walking up in my, uh, up in my bike. All right, folks, this is Nito with AP 2020 Outdoors. Spent about half an hour talking with the landowner. He really loves that back cue bike. Maybe he'll get one. Anyways, we'll see you later. Next time I'm out here, maybe I'll be doing some groundhog hunting. Support that Second Amendment. We'll see you later.